Well, this has been slated. We've been looking at this for quite some time to replace this tower. Obviously, it's, a, it's almost 100 years old. It's reaching its end of life. Charlie Berkmeyer, project manager for the city of Antigo, says they are making strides toward replacing the water tower on First Avenue. This water tower is nearly 100 years old. It served its purpose and it's ready for retirement. A $1.5 million loan from the DNR will help fund the new tower. Tommy Horswell, project manager for Infrastructure Alternatives, says the new tower will be even bigger. This tower here holds 150,000 gallons. The new tower will hold 200,000 gallons. So we will be able to supply more water to the city. It will also increase our fire flow capacity for being able to fight fires throughout the city. The DNR's safe drinking fund might have specific guidelines, but the project team is working to meet those demands. It's a combination, you know, we work with the city, some with the public. We also, you know, have to keep the state happy with regulations and everything else. Frank Meyer says the tower's color and logo have not been determined yet, but the water quality will remain top notch. The water quality stays the same. Uh, obviously, the, all the water goes filtered through the water plant uh, and then comes out into the water towers. So, yeah, they shouldn't notice a difference. The process for construction and deconstruction might surprise residents. For a brief time, there will be two towers on the block. Well, obviously we have to first construct a new tower first. Uh, get that one up, get it in service, and as soon as that one's in service, then we can begin taking this, removing this structure. The project is expected to start next spring and continue through 2024. In Antigo, Jessica Lighty, Newswatch 12.